Welcome back to the channel guys. Today is April 29th. We got all our rye off. Um, we are in full full swing of uh, field work here. We have two manure tanks going. Should be finished today with uh, covering our rye ground. Uh, I'm heading out in the field to start southerding to work ahead of the corn planter here. My uncle is running the corn planter. He's working on the dairy ground right now. Top it off with fuel here before we hit the road. Well that ain't right. Well I got that figured out. Just had to increase the hydraulic speed of the, the flow. still planting don't know when he'll stop or if he'll stop I'm assuming he will but I'll tune back in here when things get going again good morning 
guys. It's Friday, the next day. As you saw yesterday, ended the way it ended. But uh, we're going to start mowing today. Second half, tread a cow. Uh, after school, I'll probably come back and start tedding. I want to open station oil pump, took a kaput. So we'll be running our other 7405 and then our 7420. It'd be nice to get the cab tractor, but I'll probably get the open station. It's a little windy, but it's actually not that bad. If anything, that might feel good. All right, just got back from school. We're gonna go to the farm. I'm gonna drop off lunch for my dad, and then we will start Salfording. We have, we already have two people going on the tethers, so I don't need to take anyone's place. So I'm gonna hit across from where I live with the Salford, and hopefully finish that up, and maybe start some over where I live. Yeah, it's windy, as you guys can probably tell. Didn't change much since yesterday. Yesterday was kind of windy. But we're gonna start southering in here. It's uh not so windy in here. It's much nicer in here. Just resumed on what we left off on uh, yesterday when we got rained out. But yeah, it's just a nice ride. I got my snacks strapped in. Don't want this, my snacks going anywhere. You gotta strap in the ones you care about. Neighbors are spreading manure over there, but I can't tell what that, like, what is that? Like, it's not a John Deere, but like, you know, what is that? We're uh, coming down the home stretch here for this uh, decent sized field. And then we'll work on the other side here. And then we'll be down in front, uh, across the road from where I live. There used to be a house, I think a barn or a couple barns or small sheds anyhow, and there was a crop store silo. And right here is where the lane used to be. You can tell it's been a couple, of, I don't know how many years now, it's more than a couple, but yeah, it's it's a rough spot there to cross when they're moving at 12 miles an hour. You gotta make sure you slow down unless you want to get thrown out of your seat. big field done. Round two. Well, we got the second field done. I think I'm going to start softening where uh, I live. Just until feeding time. I know I'm not gonna finish the field, but I can hack at it in a while. Well, I thought I'd knock out some short rows before feeding here, so I'll uh, buy some calves to bring out. And, you know, same old process here. Uh, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. We'll hopefully be uh, chopping uh, triticale here. So, see you guys in the next one. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.